Being restricted to his residence is not stopping Charlie McDougall from doing his part for community. Charlie has committed to walking laps around his home at Burlington Gardens. He says it all started because of a birthday challenge. The basis of the challenge was my 90th birthday, which was April 25th. And my daughters uh, conceived the idea that I usually walk around the little community here once or twice a day, and they said that it would be quite uh, a feat if I were to walk, if I were to match the number of times around the community with my birthday. In other words, 90, 90 laps for 90 years. Then other family members heard about it, and there was the, the commitment that for every lap around the community, they would contribute $2 per lap to the benefit of whatever organization I chose. And that community charity is the Burlington Salvation Army Family Services. Charlie is hoping to raise $2,500. Executive Director Doug Binner says this just demonstrates how everyone can make a contribution. You know, we've had some large organizations and, and big companies who have, have, have made big contributions. We've had, we've had neighborhoods who, who do food drives. We've had individuals who have, have made donations of various kinds of cash or of food. But, but to hear Charlie's story, it just reminded me that everybody can make some kind of a contribution. And it doesn't matter what your station of life is, and it doesn't matter how old you might be. Charlie's making a difference. To date, Charlie is about halfway through his 90 lap commitment, a commitment that has also inspired the Burlington Foundation. President and CEO Colleen Maholland says they will be matching Charlie's contribution. I really do believe he stands by the same philosophy that the Burlington Foundation does, which is if we all do a little bit, then we're all doing a great deal. Um, and I was just so inspired and so compelled um, you know, to kind of cheer uh, Charlie on, Salvation Army is a fantastic charity in our community. And certainly all this support has made Charlie excited and a little nervous at the same time. Oh, I'm, I'm elated. Uh, I, I feel, <laughs> I feel that uh, a little pressure, uh, but I'm enjoying it. Uh, I don't like being the center of attention on anything. But it looks like, uh, you know, the, the, the focus is on me, of course, to finish this. Although Charlie doesn't expect anyone to help him achieve his goal, I think maybe you and I can by walking with him in spirit in our own neighborhoods or just by giving him your toonie. I know he's got mine. Okay, well, I'm going to go for my walk. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Melissa Candelaria.